Hey, I'll say this. The best victory is the one in which everyone wins. Think about that. The best victory is the one in which everyone wins. Now, the issue here, right? And I see this so much, right? Because I coach people through creating a great mindset, a high level of energy, fitness, strength, health. And the people that invest in me are understanding that they have to give some of their time, their energy, and obviously their money to in invest in, in getting a result, right? And it's the same with you. It's the same in anything you want. If you truly want it, and you truly want to get good at it, get better at it, you need to invest time, energy, and money. And through that, we have the perspective that if we do that, we're selfish because we're spending time, spending money on myself and not giving it to someone else. We have the perspective that it's disrespectful to feel great sometimes, which is mad, but we do. We have this idea that, oh, I should be pleasing somebody else, who I feel guilty. The whole guilt thing, guilt tripping, guilt tripping for spending time on your own, for spending time and energy and money on yourself. But when it comes to your health, right, there is nothing more important than you feeling good. Nothing. So I hear people all the time just saying, I haven't got time. Oh, I can't afford it. Oh, it's the kids. Like I get excuses all the time, right? But a lot of the time, people actually just feel guilty for spending time on themselves, for investing in them. But in reality, if you want to invest in your health and get higher levels of energy, motivation, self-control, confidence, fitness, have a better heart health, like surely not only would that make you feel amazing, surely that would benefit your kids because they'd get a better, more patient mother or father. Surely that would benefit your partner because you'd argue less because you'd be more chilled out and you wouldn't be as highly strong because you'd have some way to release your frustration or energy in a constructive environment if you are training physically, for example. Surely if you're invested in your mindset so that you could handle your emotions better, surely that would affect your family more positively because you'd be more present when you were with them. So here's the thing, when you want to improve your quality of life, and yes, you're going to have to be willing to invest time and energy, and yes, money, because you value what you invest in. If you pay, you pay attention. If you're looking for cheap or free, it's no wonder that you're still struggling. You've got to remember this. This is a life lesson. But the most important thing is the victory, the result, right? Everyone wants the triumph, right? Obviously, there's work to be done to get there, regardless of whether it's losing weight, getting fit, changing a business, um, starting a new lifestyle, you know, anything. You've got a goal and you want the victory. But a lot of the time, we have this unconscious level of guilt. Oh, oh, I, shouldn't. oh I shouldn't. I shouldn't feel so good about myself. Oh, I can't spend that money on just me and my thing. Me, me husband would have, have a, you know, a real problem with that. Oh, Oh, me missus would have an argument if I did that, if I spent that much money. Hey, you know what? The best victory is the one where everyone wins. Stop perceiving investing money in your health and your mind and your body as selfish. There's nothing selfish about you feeling good. Yes, if you are spending money on expensive handbags and at nights out and cocaine and Bugatti cars maybe, or crazy st stupid stuff and things, but when it comes to your health, physical and mental, you should be willing to pay whatever it fucking takes because you'll get a victory from working on yourself in that capacity. And the best victory is the one where everyone wins, not just you. And when you feel better physically and mentally, but believe me, everybody fucking wins. You've got to consider this whole thing about I can't afford it or I don't have time or all these excuses that you use. It's not a cost and it's never a cost to pay through energy, through time, through money, for your health. Never. It's an investment. An investment where is, you, where is where you get more in return for what you initially pay. We understand about investing in a home and house. We do it all the time. We, we understand about that, investing, because we believe in 20 years, 30 years, when the mortgage is paid off, we will get more back for the house than we invested. That's an investment. You've got to think about this with your health, even more so, because you might not even live to see your mortgage paid off if your health's ill, physical and mental. So there's nothing more important than you feeling good. And remember, the best victory is the one where everybody wins. 
How would your life look like with more motivation, energy, and self-control? My second book, Supercharged, is available now, the modern-day guide to creating outstanding levels of energy, motivation, and self-control. Head to superchargedbook.com to get your copy right away.